that we've had. And we're now into the gold medal match here of the mixed teams competition. And we're featuring Ryo Su Jung and Lee Sun Yun of Korea up against Dia Siddiq and Muhammad Hakim Ahmed Rubel hey. of Bangladesh. And there is the first arrow from Ryu. Which, uh, unsurprisingly, for Korean fans is a 10. Nine. Oh, real remember and Lee already won gold here at these Asian Championships and now the locals get excited because the two teenagers are out there for Bangladesh Muhammad Hakim Ahmed Rubel 19 years of age hey. won the bronze medal in the men's teams competition earlier and Dia Sadiq who of course was at the Olympic Games in Tokyo she won bronze in the women's teams earlier Highly promising young archer coming out of Bangladesh at the moment. Hey. So 19 plays 16. Ten. going to be very tough for these young Bangladeshis, even though they're highly promising and to beat these seasoned international archers here. Nine. Oh, Wynn just got up there on Lee, and he's uh, started with two nines, and that will win the first set. Lee, of course, is an Olympic champion, remember, from Rio in 2016. Nine. Nine. So the Koreans have totaled 38 in their first set. And even if Sadiq gets a 10 here, it won't be enough. Seven, maybe eight. Oh, long hold on that last arrow there, Nikki. But uh, so Sadiq just struggling to settle early in this match. Yeah, I'm sure there's some nerves out there. You know, they're against a, a big Korean team. We've got a lot of home support. We can hear them in the background cheering for them. So, you know, they've just got to try and stick to their normal processes and get as much experience out of this match as possible. They're there smiling, which is great to see, and just enjoy that experience and do the best they can. Well, they've uh, had a good campaign here. Sadiq made the quarterfinals of the individual. And as a touched on, bronze medalist in the teams. And uh, Ruvel also got to the quarterfinals of the individual. And that's wonderful to see. Some enthusiastic support for the two young archers competing at home here in these Asian championships. Team gold medal match. Team Korea 2, Bangladesh 0. So Korea win that first set by 38 to 32. Lee and Ryu, remember, going for two golds in the session. Having already won the women's and the men's team's gold, respectively. So here we go, set number two in the mixed team's gold medal match. Rubel to go first. Eight. We could see Sadiq just practicing her execution movement as she was waiting to come onto the line there. It's a good opportunity just to run through your mental processes, what feelings you want to get in the shot. Eight. Both gone high left, but I can't see. I don't think the conditions are the reason for that. There doesn't seem to be too much wind in the venue. Yes, only just uh, the one gold score so far for Bangladesh. Hey. And Ryu there is the best archer out there at the moment. Three tens in a row to start the match. Nine. 
Nine. Nine. So 19 to 16. Exactly the same scores at the halfway stage of this set as the first set. Nine. Just checking with the coach, still going high left, so need to talk as a team, make their adjustments. Eight. Now it uh, finishes that second set. Just a one-point improvement on their first set. So Korea, to win the second, need 15. Ten. And there's 10 of them. Korea is going brilliantly. Wow. And there's the first 10 from Lee, and the Koreans now looking really strong. Score of 39. They've just dropped the one point in that set. They win it by six. Nikki, and I'm going back through Ryu's scoring from the women's team's gold. In the, if you take the arrows she scored in that one and then add these ones to it, this is her score sheet so far. 10, 10, 10, 9, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Not, not too bad, I'd say, you know. <laughs> <Room for improvement. laughs> no, she's an amazing yeah. archer, isn't she? Um, you know, she's an under-18 world champion from 10 years ago. Um, and this is her first senior debut for the Korean team. I mean, she's a phenomenal archer. She came, became the second archer ever to shoot over 1,400 on a World Archery 1440 round, so absolute quality. Well, that just reinforces, doesn't it? How good the Koreans are, and we talk about that often in all the events that we cover here. So set number three now, it is Korea leading by four set points to nil. In the mixed team's gold medal match, and here goes Rubel to start set three. Nine. Ten. First ten of the match from Sadiq. Just the right time to remember Bangladesh need to either tie or win the set to prolong the contest. Oh, Ryu just continues to roll on. Unbelievable scoring. Nine. So 19 apiece. So can Bangladesh keep it going here, Nikki? They've really got to put the pressure on. A tie isn't enough. It's best of four sets. You know, if it gets to five, you win. So they've got to win this outright. Got to put the pressure on now. Nine. Well, it comes down to Rubel. He hasn't got a 10 in the match so far, and he would love to have one now. Yes, he loved it. Stared it down, didn't he? That brilliant archery from the youngsters. 38 from 40. But two tens will get the job done here for Korea. Even a nine and a ten will do it. And Rio's got the perfect run rolling still. In incredible archery from her. So Lee, a nine will square the set and it will be enough to win the gold medal. Nine. And there it is. It's another gold to Korea in these mixed teams competition this time. 
Brilliant archery from Lee and Ryu. Solid effort from Lee. Actually, he just had the 110 on his scorecard, <laughs> but his partner, Ryu, Nikki, was just extraordinary. Six tens from six arrows in that match. She is something else. She really is absolutely incredible. You know, 70 meters away that target. The tens are size of a CD. And, you know, they've picked up another 38 points there, tied the set, and that is enough to take the match. They have got it in the bag. They win it by five set points to one. So, so really good effort from Sadiq and Rubel to get a point out of that match, given their shaky start. But they scored really well in that last set, but they just, in the end, were no match for Ryu and Lee, who were just a class above. So it's double gold for this pair in this session. And they were absolutely brilliant, particularly Ryu, who has just been on fire all through the session. So there we are, five set points to one. And this last arrow from Lee, good enough, that nine for the win in this match.